I'm Lauren Moss with today's Ag Day Minute. The Biden administration is looking to reduce the prices you pay for meat at the grocery store by increasing competition within the meat industry. The administration is targeting meat processing plants. It says the top four meat companies control 85% of the beef market. The administration plans to distribute one billion from the coronavirus relief package to help independent meat processors expand. Consumer prices in November rose 6.8% over the prior 12 months. That's a 39 year high. There are new rules when it comes to the labeling of genetically modified foods at the grocery store. The changes are part of the Department of Ag's new rules on genetically modified organisms, or GMOs. As of January 1st, foods on supermarket shelves will be labeled as having been bioengineered instead. But some of the old labels consumers are familiar with will remain like certified USDA organic and non-GMO project verified. A winter storm moving into the mid-Atlantic was forecasted to bring as much as 10 inches of snow, also bringing some snow to the Sunshine State. Flurries were spotted in Okaloosa County, Florida. Snow. The light snow falling in the Florida Panhandle early Monday morning. It's amazing to think the day before, temps were in the 70s. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on this station or anytime at agweb.com.